Good morning, GMS. I'm Gianna. And my name is Aiden. And welcome to the GMS News Show for the week of November 11th. This month's new root value for November is thankfulness. This means when someone shows gratitude or is being grateful, let someone you appreciate know that you are thankful for them. Only one more month to order a yearbook at a discounted price. You can order one at yearbookforever.com before the price increases. Plus, Mr. Sutton will autograph your yearbook for free, so that yeah. is great value. Speaking of yearbooks, are you interested in joining the GMS yearbook team? Do you like writing stories or taking pictures? If you are interested in helping create our GMS yearbook, see Mrs. New in room 3112. Any students interested in joining the Greenwood Middle School Best Buddies program, please see Mrs. Webb in the art room. If you need to know more about Best Buddies, check out last week's news video for a short informational video. Today, November 11th, is, is the annual Veterans Day Convocation in the GMS Gym. This is to honor all veterans who have served in the armed forces to protect our freedoms. Thank you all for your service. All this week, GMS will be competing in a penny war. This is hosted by the National Junior Honor Society. Each grade will have a bucket where they can deposit pennies and change during lunch. A penny is worth one point. If you put nickels, dimes, or quarters in another grade's bucket, it will lower their score. The class with the most points at the end of the week will win a full week of E-Day. So start digging through your couch cushions. Every penny counts. Now let's go to the interview of the week with Sam, Top Trending with Carter, Sports with Eva, and, and a GMS flashback. Hello, my name is Sam and welcome to the interview for this week. Here with me is Mrs. New. How are you doing? I'm doing well. How are you? Hey, let's start off with the first question. What is your favorite part about teaching? I would say my favorite part about teaching is impacting kids. It, trying to make a difference in their life, even if it's the smallest thing that they remember me saying, that I know I've made even the tiniest impact for them. Okay, question number two. If you weren't a science teacher, what would you be? If I weren't a science teacher, I would probably be an interior designer um, or uh, kind of something in the exercise wellness field. My original degree was in exercise science, but I love to do design and decorating, so that's what I would do instead. Okay, question three is, I heard you were the cross-country coach. How has your season gone? The season has gone very well this year. Uh, the boys team really advanced pretty far. We came second in the mid-state and second in county, which is pretty big. We only lost to Perry Meridian, which is a big school, and Santa Rosa Central. So we beat a lot of teams that are bigger than us, so went very well this year and excited to see what's going to come. Okay. Question four is, how do you think the team will be next year? We have a lot of spaces to fill in the team, a lot of eighth grade boys who are moving on, so they'll do great at the high school, but that means I need a lot of recruits in for the boys team. I think the girls team will only get stronger. I had a big group of sixth grade girls that will hopefully continue on and get stronger as the years go. So need to fill a little bit of a gap for the boys team, but my girls, I think they stick with it. We're gonna be a lot stronger this coming year. Okay, and the last question is, what do you like to do in your free time? In my free time, I run a lot. Um, a lot of people don't like that, but I enjoy running, so I run a lot. Um, I like to decorate, design, do crafts, and that's basically it. Okay, thank you, Miss New. That was the interview for this week. Now back to the studio. Hello and welcome to Top Trending, where we discuss the latest trends of the week. I am Carter, number three, Black Friday. 
Black Friday happens the day after Thanksgiving and is the biggest shopping day of the year. Every company comes out with huge sales and discounts on their products. People wake up as early as 2 a.m. and even earlier just to get in line at some popular stores like Best Buy and Target. Some people also shop online to get these good deals and not have to fight the crowds. Will your family face the crowds and go Black Friday shopping or shop online? Number two, AirPods Pro. AirPods Pro came out October 30th and they're getting a bunch of feedback. The new AirPods have a new design that are smaller and have better sound quality. People like the audio and the fact that they are noise canceling. Noise canceling technology blocks out the sound around you but can also help drain your battery. Many people don't really like the wider design and price. They are selling for $250. Are you going to put the AirPods Pro on your wish list? Number one, Shane Dawson. The popular YouTuber Shane Dawson has recently made a comeback after a five month break. The start quickly pleased his fans by saying he was collaborating with makeup artist and popular YouTuber Jeffree Star to create his own makeup palette and some other products. We are sure this star is going to keep growing in popularity and gain more fans with his new release. That's all for Top Trending this week. See you next week. Hello, my name's Eva and we're going to take a look at the sports for this week. On Tuesday, November 12th, the 7th grade boys basketball team will be at John Wooden Middle School at 5.30. And the 6th grade girls basketball team will be at their county tournament round one at home playing Indian Creek at 5 o'clock. On Thursday, November 14th, the 6th grade girls basketball team will be playing their county tournament round two away at 5 p.m. Now back to the studio. How to behave in the hallways. I'm Hannah Anderson. Walking on the right side of the hallway is always right. That's rule number one. Rule number two is to respect your locker and others. Oh. Oh. Rule number three, respect others in the hallway and do not run. Here we are, just walking down the hall thinking shh, 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 shh. Here we are, just walking down the hall thinking shh, shh, shh. Thank you for watching this week's episode of GMS News. I am Gianna. And I am Aiden. Please visit our website and our YouTube channel to, vi to submit show ideas and, suggest and suggestions. Have a great week, GMS.